Seems a strange decision. I really feel the conditions are going to be tricky to bat in at the start. The openers are really going to have to concentrate in the early overs. OK, everything looks set to get this match underway. I think the new ball will get some movement, and the openers are going to have to be wary of that. Massive outside edge. A lot of pressure coming to the crease. Not had the best of weeks leading up to this game, so I want to show everyone their strength. Ah, oh, that's a biggie. Oh, that is huge. All the way for a maximum. And it's gone many rows deep. Well, that's a waste of a delivery. Absolutely no trouble getting onto it and dispatching it for six. I'd like to see them just aim for the top of off now. As a bowler, you've got to make them play on your terms. Straight drive, mid-off will cut that one off. Erz on the side of bowling, slightly fuller, and they've been put away. Kennedy is finding it difficult to contain this pair at the moment. My advice would be go back to your stock delivery and then build from there. Threaded it through brilliantly. All timing on that shot. That last ball isn't something you want to repeat of. You don't want to be giving away easy runs. Big edge, where's that going? Kennedy shouldn't be too worried about that last ball. They've got them playing their shots. Just need to tighten their areas now. Huge edge. End of a high scoring over. Beautiful batting. After hitting the boundary that many times, there's high confidence out in the middle. End of the first and an exceptional start. Some big shots early on. Can build some momentum easily off that over. Big edge. Just got to follow up that last delivery. Found the edge, but no reward, but putting pressure on the batter. Doesn't beat the infield. Bowled him, straight through, good swing coming back in. The trudge back to the pavilion. A disappointing display in the end for someone with such batting skills. This one goes down as a fail. A difficult period as they come to the wicket. They'll take plenty of time to settle themselves in before facing their first ball. Can't get that outside the ring field. Perfectly timed. Well, what a lovely shot. It flew to the boundary. That's clearly not the type of delivery to be bowling here. Getting nicely settled at the crease now. Would have to be very happy with that last shot.
Collects that one, simple as you like, inside the ring. Four runs out of there. Ireland, a 24 for one. Another massive over of power hitting. Run rate did dip a bit, though, although I don't think they'll complain much about this start. The left-arm pace bowler is coming into the attack from the south end. Too good. That is huge. Managed to get onto the front foot early and just incredible power to loft that over the boundary. That's incredible. Just the power on that shot. That's the sort of thing you want to see in the crowd when you come to the cricket. Always difficult to focus after what happened last ball, but you just got to stay positive and believe the wicket's going to come. That was a tremendous delivery. Fizz through to the wicketkeeper. No more short balls this over. Massive outside edge. Let's just see if they can get that ball up into the slot as before. It's so crucial. You've got to follow up that last delivery and keep the batter under pressure. That is huge, enormous, massive, gigantic. Take your pick. That was seen so early. The timing was brilliant. And that has stayed hit. Fantastic. Don't always mind getting hit for runs. What's important is just focus on getting the next delivery right. Onto that early, that could be four. That's ten from two. Great shot making, really well timed and feels like someone is in a hurry. End of the over and a very nicely bowled one. Not much opportunity to score runs there. Anderson, the left arm pace bowler, is coming into the attack from the north end. Great shot, pulled straight to backward square leg though. You just can't hit it any better than that. Beautiful shot, no chance at all for the fielders. Patel, I don't think, will be too happy with their bowler at the moment. Edged it. Time to follow up after such a great delivery. Pitch it on a length is obviously the way to go. Shot on the front foot. No one's getting that. Watched it closely out of the hand and hammered that slower ball away to the boundary.
The last one helped the scoring rate, making their intentions for this innings. Pulled away, but straight to square leg. Ten runs at it there. Ireland, a 53 for one. Kerr, the left-arm orthodox bowlers, coming into the attack from the south end. Thick edge. Time to keep the pressure on now. Great ball, that last one, to find the edge. It's just a case of finding the same spot. Perfect, right out of the middle and bludgeons that one to the boundary. Well, you sometimes just have to stop and admire batting like that. Gets onto the front foot early, well-timed and four runs. Do they go full? Do they go short? A lot to ponder this delivery after the boundary. That was a nick. It's a missed chance, and that could well be four. This delivery just needs to be pitched up on a length. Too short, and you're going to get punished on this pitch. Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder. Finds the fielder with that shot. Beats the cover fielder. Nice shot. Flashed away and got it well enough to find the boundary. And that's the end of the innings. Ireland have set a target of 67 runs. This is a very defendable total. The openers will need to get their eye in very quickly and get the scoreboard ticking over if they have any chance. McCarthy coming in. Does very well to quickly get across to this one. Straight to the fielder.
Yeah, big opportunity. They've worked really hard in recent weeks. They should have the confidence to build an innings and get a big score on the board. Massive outside edge. Cuts that off well in the infield. End of the over. Three runs coming off it. America are three for none. The right armour is coming on to bowl from the south end. Finds the edge. Top edge and just over the keeper. Might have been a little bit late reacting, but the ball runs away to the rope. Don't need to do anything special. Line and length is the key here. Couldn't get it through the field. Drilled that one away. Got it away for four. Backward of point very nicely. Yeah, it can be very disheartening seeing good delivery smacked around. Sometimes, though, you just got to accept it and move on. Power and precision in that shot. Four runs. They were so still at the crease. Just a slight movement forward. Fabulous shot. Pierced the gap wonderfully on the offside at cover. It has been a great over so far. Two boundaries from it. The runs are flowing very easily now. Still honing in on their lines. The batter happy to let it go through. Smashed all over the park. I wonder if the captain will stick with them. An excellent over by the batter, but the bowlers just reined them in a tad. Going with pace now. Gone. Great reflexes. Simple as you like, the batter didn't bother to look at more than one delivery in that over. Well, was that a lazy shot or a good piece of bowling? And the field was set and they fell for it. Out for a duck. New batter comes to the crease. Never an easy time to come into bat after the fall of a wicket. Edged. Pulled away and into the gap. Could be four more. A lovely shot off the back foot. The shorter ball having no joy and getting dispatched for four runs. Tried something a bit different last delivery and the captain shouldn't mind that too much. If they get it right, they just might get that wicket. Big edge.
edged it. Ireland goes up strong, but the batter doesn't feel they got anything on that. Now oh, that's just outrageous. An innings that promised much and really, in the end, delivered very little. Pretty disappointing all round. A new batter always likes to feel bad on ball as they bring a bit of nervous energy to the wicket. Square cut, finds point, no run. End of the over, four runs coming off it. America, 19 for two. Little, the left armour, is coming into the attack from the south end. <laughs> Nearly gets the edge. Little with a great delivery there. Misses everything. shot finds a gap with that one you can't fault the bowling sometimes your opponent is just too good wonderful front foot shot and there was no point chasing that that last ball isn't something you want to repeat of you don't want to be giving away easy runs Time that perfectly. That was a lovely flowing drive through the covers to pick up the four. Back to back boundaries. Can they make it three in a row? Really put the bowler on the back foot. Oh, thought that was passing, but a fantastic dive to cut it off. End of the over. Nine runs coming from it. America, a 28 for two. Adair, the pace bowler, coming into the attack. Pulled away, but straight to square leg. You can't hit the ball much better than that. Timed it to perfection. I'd like to see them just aim for the top of off now. As a bowler, you've got to make them play on your terms. Onto that early, that could be four. Threaded it through brilliantly. All timing on that shot. A uh, good contest here at the moment. Four off the last ball. It'll be interesting to see how the bowler can respond. Lovely cover drive, but straight to the extra cover fielder. Erz on the side of bowling slightly fuller, and they've been put away. Getting nicely settled at the crease now. Would have to be very happy with that last shot. Still honing in on their lines. The batter happy to let it go through. They really need a boundary, this ball. Brilliant diving stop.
That's a great win. It really did feel that the first innings display had put enough runs on the board and they've been able to defend it. Great bowling. That's all from us in the commentary box. It's been an amazing match. Hope to see you again soon.